purpose of me being here. Morning Zoe, uh, morning Poppy, <coughs> uh, morning Serena, uh, is to test ketones and bloods before I have a, um, a full bulletproof coffee um, and then go shopping to Morrison's because they'll be open in a few minutes. Right. So, if you hadn't seen, I did this test yesterday after a run. So I came home, I run in a fasted state. So bloods yesterday morning were 4.3, so that was after the run. Um, my ketones were 2.7, and then an hour later, my bloods had gone down to 3.9, not unnormal for me, um, and my ketones had gone to three. So the Bulletproof Coffee didn't have a, a negative effect on me yesterday after exercise. Obviously, I don't run 10 miles every day, so let's see what it does on a normal day. So we've been out for a walk. So bloods, 4.3. Are they the same as after a run? That, uh, yes. So it, again, that's normal for me. I, I very rarely see um, high bloods. This is the one that's uh, the biggest difference from yesterday because you wouldn't expect me to have anywhere close to two after just getting up and walking Point around. One. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> one, one, 1. 1.8. Right, okay. So I'll be honest, that's 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 fairly high for yeah, me in the normally you're out I mean it's one. not normally that high. You know, my my normal readings, I mean this is for somebody that um if you're just starting out and you know, my normal readings are around about one. Um, you know, a lot of times we've done a test and they've been zero point seven, mm. which is low end for me. Generally it's one, one point one. So one point eight is a is a is a it's a good score. Um, it's just not normal to have 1.8 first thing in the morning. Right, so my version of fat fueled salted butter. So this is the Aldi, sorry, salted butter. Love this one. Your proper um, butter, as you call it. My, my posh butter, which costs about £1.50 a pack. Um, not exactly posh. 10 grams, 10 grams of organic coconut oil. So again, this is just the Aldi version. It's it's about two quid. It's not, it's about a teaspoon. I wouldn't normally weigh this out when I'm doing it. I'll just take a little slither, take a little spoon, and some full fat coffee. We've got caffeinated for the morning. Oh look, there's a tea towel behind me. <laughs> we, had a, we had a tea towel troll a few days ago. Oh, it made me laugh. Tea towel troll. Apparently tea towels can't be grey, as in like the actual fabric be grey. Right, so it doesn't look too appealing right now. It's not really done anything. Uh, Nutribullet, please be careful if it's, if it's very hot. I've had this off the stand for a few minutes. So it's very hot. You know, sealed it, sealed container. <laughs> It. That's all it needs. So it looks like a latte, and everyone that I've ever sort of made this for, and um, <clears throat> they've had a taste. It's a it's a great latte alternative. Look at it. Now I don't regularly, not every day. I mean, it's a lie today, obviously, because I had one yesterday and today. But I don't have a bulletproof every day. Uh, they're not needed. Um, why bother? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like everyone's caffeine addicts as well. Then I, I think Sunday morning is sort of like you know, even even I was like I need a coffee this zone. morning. Yeah. Sunday morning, we just think now. Do you know what? Sod it. Let's have a, let's have a full full version. Uh, hello. Right, I'm back from shopping. Um, took a bit longer than I anticipated because they had loads of uh, reduced meat and fish. So I've got bags of stuff. <laughs> um, but I've got a hot. I've got a what on earth? Holy cow! Rainbow trout fillet. It's a fiver for a hot, for a side of rainbow trout. I mean, that's just amazing. So an hour ago, or just over, it was about an hour and fifteen minutes. Let's have a look. Um, anyway, I did uh, an hour and a half actually. Now um, I did a blood and ketone reading um, after after going for a walk before. Drinking a bulletproof, yes it was Morrison's mate, and I've got that liver, uh, yeah the uh, veal liver that you picked up as well. Um, so my bloods were 
an hour, what, an hour and a half ago, I'll be open and honest, and my ketones were 1.8. I've since had that bulletproof coffee, or fat fueled. Um, so it was 10, 10, bleh, 10 grams of, that got nowhere near going through my skin. Um, ouch. Oh, come on, blood. <laughs> Um, Stop using the same finger and maybe it'll no, be No, I went easier. the opposite side. Um, so uh, I made my fat fuel coffee with 10 grams of butter, the um, salted with the salt crystals in it. So my blood's are 4.5, so gone up by 0 0.2, so normal. Um, so 10 grams of butter and 10 grams of coconut oil, flavoured organic stuff, my favourite. Um, so it's about... Just short of 200 calories worth of fat. I am thirsty. I am, I've not had any water or anything like that. 1.5. So I've gone down by 0 0.3 over the hour and a half. So I'm quite happy with that. Disclaimer, Eat. these are your results. Not everyone's yeah, disclaimer, same. these are my results. My ketone started off at a good level. Um, 1.8, which is good for the morning for me. Um, obviously a drop of 0 0.3 means that I'm still in nutritional ketosis. So, um, 200 calories and it hasn't broken my ketones, I haven't uh, come out of ketosis um, because it is all fat calories. So, um, and it's enabled me to just get on with my, my morning. Again, I was having this conversation a couple of minutes ago, I think it was with Donna and Isabel. Depends on your goal for fasting. So your goal is just because it's you know mental clarity yeah. ketones all of that if you're trying to lose weight with fasting maybe you don't have a bulletproof coffee i wouldn't have, yeah i wouldn't have a bulletproof in the mornings so I'd, I'd very rarely have a bulletproof sue chafer um, is waiting in the in the uh, the zoom room right okay gonna go because we've got a zoom uh bye